All right, so we're in Berlin. It's about three degrees Celsius. Um, we're driving out to a slaughterhouse. We had to hire a car. Um, I'm driving in Europe for the first time with the right hand drive and on the right hand side of the road, so it's a bit confusing. But we're driving up to a pig slaughterhouse to go bear witness. And I don't know anything about this place until we arrive. So we'll have to see what happens. All right, I reckon this is them up there. There's police there. So they've got a truck stopped in the middle of the road. Film the activists. Let's have a look. There's a fire inside your heart. And let it light up the world. Light up the world. It's Mr. Truck, eh? Oh my God, there's a puppy in there. <laughs> Hello. Hello, darling. How are you all? Hi. Nice to meet you. How are you? Hi. How many trucks have been here? Oh, about six, I think. Six? Oh, what? Four thousand picks every day. Four thousand a day here. What is it? Gas chambers? Yes. Gas Hi, chambers. Hi, Hello. Hello. Nice to meet you. How are you? Fine. That's good. <laughs> yeah. You're Joey. I'm Joey. Yeah. Okay. I'm working for a local newspaper okay. here, and uh, we are trying uh, to make some picture and report about this, what you're doing here. Yeah. Um, and you just came from Australia? I come from Australia. I actually just flew from Italy. And why did you come uh, especially here? We are Berlin? To, in a, this is, uh, to this place. This slaughterhouse? Yeah. Why did we come to this slaughterhouse? Is this the closest slaughterhouse to Berlin? Yeah. yeah. Two hours away, it's the closest slaughterhouse. It's a big slaughterhouse, 4,000 uh, pigs here killed a yeah. day. Yeah. I think this is a gas chamber. All right, so pigs just like these ones, in a gas chamber much like this, being murdered in a place, facility behind us, in the middle of Germany here. <clears throat> Absolutely disgraceful. Human, human beings should hang their head in shame for this should hang their head in shame and change their ways. This is not how we treat other life, other sentient life. There are several kinds of killing, uh, of killing the animals. Um, they do it like this and this. Well, this usually with pigs, they kill yeah. them in gas chambers because yeah. they thrash around. Yeah. And um, like if they clean out the bottom of the gas chamber, sometimes their limbs yeah. are at the bottom because they tear their own limbs off yeah. in, the, in the gas. That's horrible. Mm -hmm. Really disgusting to see. If you've seen the, the footage from the gas chambers, it's uh, mm. really disturbing to watch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. yeah I, I, um, you can um, imagine. So I would like to show you a gas chamber. Yeah, yeah. So they go into this, um, it's like a gondola. Down the bottom is the CO2. Yeah. Yeah, I can imagine um, um, you're doing this uh, all of the time, um, being an activist in this in, 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 in case of the animals. Uh, yeah, well, while animals are being butchered and murdered for no yeah. no reason, I will yeah. uh, go around and try to raise awareness about it. Yeah. 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 I don't think it's necessary. I think it's uh, cruel yeah. to take someone's life from them. Yeah. We have alternatives now, plant-based yeah. options. Yeah. No one had to die. Mm. I don't think gas chambers are a moral way to treat yeah. uh, sentient beings. I mean, we should have learnt in history that gas yeah. chambers are wrong. It's a quite strange thing to do this in Germany. Yeah. It's a strange thing to, yeah, yeah. to have gas yeah, chambers yeah. killing sentient yeah, yeah. beings in yeah. Germany. I don't think a pig is any morally different to a dog. We wouldn't mm. put dogs in gas chambers and stab yes. them for bacon, but we do mm. it for, to pigs. They eat, them by, how, they eat them by the million here a year? Pigs, probably? Yeah, think, they kill yeah. 16 million. 16 million. One of the most intelligent animals yeah. on earth too, pigs. Yeah. Yeah. I remember having been in a slaughterhouse when I started yeah. working for a newspaper. And I know afterwards I uh, didn't. didn't. I didn't eat. Uh, I didn't eat meat for a very long time. I'm not. I'm, I'm no vegetarian or something like that. Yeah. But it's, uh, it's disturbing. It's yeah. You know, it's yeah. interesting that um, uh, if you go into a slaughterhouse yeah. where yeah. animals are killed, it mm -hmm. turns you off of eating yeah. them, which yeah. doesn't show me that you're yeah. a natural carnivore. Carnivores would be hungry in there. They'd eat the corpse, blood, yeah. drink of the blood. Yeah, yeah, Human yeah. beings, we're not really built for that. Hmm. We like to be disconnected from the process. Yeah, yeah, but yeah, what yeah. we like to do is connect people to the process. We mm -hmm. say, here they are, these are the animals. To show what's really happening. Not, yeah. it's, it's not like going to the supermarket and... Purchasing some packaged yeah, yeah, flesh. Yeah. 
They're, they're struggling. Yeah. They're just trying to escape. Yeah. They're terrified in there. Yeah. Horrible, yeah? Mm -hmm. The thing is, um, the most of people are good people. Yeah. They're against animal abuse. They wouldn't yeah. want to see, they wouldn't want to contribute to what happens in there. Mm -hmm. Most people, they'll be yeah. like, no, that's horrible. But they will easily go to the supermarket yeah. and purchase it and mm -hmm. pay for it to happen. Mm -hmm. Because without the consumer, yeah. these industries don't exist. Yeah. So yeah. the blood is on their hands. Mm -hmm. Used to be on my hands for 26 years yeah. until I changed. What was your point to, to change your mind and to be to become an activist? Was it, I was... Um, did you have a, a special uh, experience? Or yeah, I did. I, pre I previously, uh, I spent a lot of my life in gangs and uh, in yeah. going down the wrong track on drugs and alcohol. Yeah. And I... Um, I changed my life around after having an epiphany uh, when, it, when I was sober in prison yeah. and I started to see my life from a new perspective. Mm -hmm. And part of that epiphany, part of that change was to stop unnecessarily harming others. I started to be conscious mm -hmm. of my actions. Yeah. I'd been harming others for a long time mm -hmm. and animals are others. Mm -hmm. So they, they, I encompass them in my new compassionate way. And I feel, I feel like animals don't have a voice the yeah. same way humans do. Mm -hmm. Humans can form a coalition and defend themselves. Yeah. Animals are helpless, defenseless, and mm -hmm. their screams are unnoticed. Mm -hmm. So they need us, human beings, to speak yeah. for them. Otherwise, they have no chance. Okay. Yeah. What do you call this? What, what would you call this? I don't have any explanation for this. Mm. It's expression for this. It's, mm. it's really horrible. So, Could we just say, like, uh, in our history, we should yeah. have learnt our lesson about yeah. gas chambers, yeah. but we still have gas chambers killing thousands of sentient yeah. beings yeah. in Germany. We yeah, should have already learnt our lesson. That's what I wanted to say. It's very yeah. strange that it is happening in Germany. Like it, this, this is a holocaust. Yeah. It, what yeah. is happening to animals yeah. is a holocaust. Holocaust, yeah. the word, means sl uh, slaughter on a yeah. mass scale. Destruction yeah. or slaughter on a mass scale. Yeah. If 4,000 sentient beings in one day, in one slaughterhouse, yeah. in one yeah. place in Germany, isn't a holocaust, yeah. okay? We're talking three trillion sentient animals every year, including marine animals. Yeah. Yeah. That dwarfs any human holocaust mm. in comparison. This is what it is. It's a massacre. Yeah. It's, uh, it's a, an absolute yeah. tragedy. Yeah. Yeah. They're like uh, three-year-old children in their mind. Yeah. They're, yeah. they're really scared and terrified. Yeah. 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 They don't want to die. Then they come, up, they come out stunned. Mm. Then when they come out the other end, mm. they're stabbed in the throat, drained of their blood. Chopped up into pieces and served to people. Six months old, six month old pigs, mm -hmm. little infant, like mm -hmm. infants, mm -hmm. and all for a five minute meal. Mm -hmm. This mm -hmm. meal is gone as quick as you eat it. That's mm -hmm. it, their entire life. Yeah. A life of suffering sometimes, yeah. or a horrible death. Okay, it will be enough at first, but I'd like to have a picture with you. Okay. I think Germans are very sensitive about the meaning of this word and I, I think there's also danger that when they hear this word they don't... Um, Associate it with what happens to pigs? Yeah, they probably just think... Uh, they will criticize you for using this word and then they are not so open anymore about the vegan message. So this could be a danger. Of course I also agree that... It's a gas there, chamber there, dude. Yes, I know. Yeah. There's a gas chamber murdering animals in there. Yeah. What is it? 4,000 animals a day, constantly, relentlessly. 4,000 a day here, worldwide. Millions, millions, billions. Gary Orofsky was in um, Israel saying mm. the same thing. Mm. Okay, and you will stay here for the next two hours or what? Yeah, what we'll stay hours? here for as many trucks that come in the next few yeah, hours. Yeah, yeah. What we do, the, the, the reason this is effective, it's not just us standing out the front yeah. here with signs, looking at yeah. animals and crying. Mm -hmm. We're taking photos, images of them, and mm -hmm. we share those images with the public and say, yeah. hey, these pigs were killed not too far away from you. Yeah. You're probably eating one of these personalities that was mm -hmm. scared and terrified and died yeah. in a gas chamber. Mm -hmm. Please stop, boycott yeah. the industry. Yeah. Slowly, slowly, demand decreases. They yeah. stop breeding animals and these industries go under. That's okay. what we rely on. Mm -hmm. Okay, the truck here is stopped. Sorry. But they wouldn't let us. No. 
Actually, can we hear the gas chambers from around the back? Does that say killer? Yeah, no, Kittler. <laughs> Kittler. But it's, it's like... There we go. It's a killer truck. Look at the look at the back. Looks like it says killer. That'll be consistent. Uh, you know, it disgusts me that they they put on the sign food group. How's a chopped up body of a murder victim that screamed for their life inside of a gas chamber? A food group. Look at this sign. It's okay. 